Noah Gent here at Calhoun's. Yeah! Welcome to Noah Gent. Let the good times roll. Calhoun's in Gatlinburg, Tennessee is on Parkway, the main drag in Gatlinburg. And then they also have a location in Pigeon Forge and then several other locations across Tennessee and the area. So let's walk on inside and check it out. It was really busy in here. This seems to be a very popular spot and uh, there was a very long wait for tables, but using my old tried and true trick, they did say we could go back to the bar and see if there was space available. First come, first serve at the bar. So as we looked around and saw so many of the tables cram full and with social distancing protocols in effect with uh, so many of the tables being not available for seating, the bar seemed like the best option. So I went back there and found a couple of seats luckily. So was great to be able to not have to wait all night for something to eat so I sat down at the bar and as I sat at the bar and looked around they had on my spears or they just called it the big beer Prost. Well, let's take a look at the menu. Uh, we do get these disposable menus due to COVID-19 and the bar was a little bit wet, so the menus got a little bit wet too. So when we look at first taste, there's smoked sausage and cheese plate, white chicken chili, smoked beef brisket chili, fried pickles, southern fried green tomatoes, charred grilled shrimp, fresh baked soft pretzels, spinach artichoke dip, seared ahi tuna, pulled pork nachos, rocky top potato skins, and bacon wrapped uh, brisket something, I can't read what that is, and then wings, and then fresh ground burgers and sandwiches. So it is uh, burgers till we get to the chicken salad club, barbecue chicken sandwich, prime rib sandwich, and hickory smoked beef brisket sandwich. And then salads. On the next page, we have our Tennessee barbecue and more with Hickory Smoke Barbecue Ribs, Calhoun's Trio, Hickory Smoke Barbecue Pork Plate, Hickory Smoke Chicken, Hand Breaded Chicken Tenders, Grilled Chicken Teriyaki, Grilled Lemon Chicken, Grilled Chicken Calhoun, Southern Fried Catfish, Char Grilled Shrimp, Char Grilled Wild Salmon, and hickory smoked beef brisket plate, and efficient chips. And then steaks, chops, and prime rib. We have a filet mignon, an eel steak, and we have a hickory smoked prime rib dinner, and then a barbecue steak Calhoun, a pork chop, a steak and shrimp combo, then for sides, we have Smoky Mountain baked beans, fresh broccoli, baked cinnamon apples, tater tots, baked potato, creamy country slaw, spinach maria, Tennessee corn pudding, french fries, rice, mac and cheese, fresh vegetable of the day, mashed potatoes, baked sweet potato, and homemade desserts are fresh key lime pie, macadamia nut banana pudding, cheesecake of the day, and Louise's triple fudge cake, and then the beverages. So while I was deciding on what to order, they brought out a nice selection of different kinds of rolls and cornbread and a biscuit. A biscuit. Cornbread. Garlic bread. Yes, please. Thank you. This is my view coming out of the bathroom, returning to the bar where I needed to wash my hands to get all the greasy butter off my hands after eating all that bread. So it began to get really dark outside very fast, and the inside of this building got very dark as all the window light that had been coming in went down with the sun. So I do apologize for this 
less than perfect footage as it was so dark inside the building now. So I ordered the brisket chili and that finally arrived to start my meal out with. And very soon after my brisket plate also arrived that I had ordered. So it was going to be a barbecue kind of night for me. So I was very disappointed with this very tiny amount of barbecue sauce and there really was no more available. So that was not pleasing to me. The brisket. Got a nice smoke flavor to it. Definitely need sauce. Very dry, so we don't have sauce. Mm. I just wanna, oh, I called, I called Grey Ball too, and that's what I was going to say. Alright, well, I'm going to get off here. Yeah, tell that. Big mug, I heard you guys love it. <laughs> okay, maybe I should have had two of the big beers. I'm having a little hard time using my fork on the broccoli here. That's got to be the worst broccoli eating I've ever done in my entire life. So the brisket plate was not the worst brisket I've ever had, but it definitely was not the best brisket I've ever had. It was really dry and I really needed a whole lot more sauce. I probably would not get this again unless they definitely did have sauce. But I still would like to probably try their steaks before I would order this again. The rolls were the next thing that was better than the brisket. Um, I did enjoy the basket of rolls of various types. They were all pretty good rolls. I especially liked the garlic bread and the biscuit. The brisket chili was quite good and it was an improvement over the brisket plate substantially as it combined the really good smoky flavor the brisket had along with the missing moistness that really brought out additional flavor that was missing without sauce on the brisket plate. So it leads me to think that the brisket plate probably could have been a lot better with more sauce. And my favorite thing at Calhoun's was the En Masse, the leader beer, or as they call it, the big beer. So, this by far was the big winner. They had a great selection of beer here also, uh, some local brews. So good times with that here. This was my favorite thing about Calhoun's by far. So the bill arrived and it was $49.50 with tip. They didn't do a paper printed receipt uh, due to the COVID-19 and doing everything electronically. So just under $50. Um, I would return again. I would like to try some of their steaks and other items. I don't know if I'd ever get the brisket plate again, uh, but the big beers, the Iron Mass Leader beers are a big winner with me, so I would return simply for that. And it's a beautiful night in Gatlinburg and a great night to be here. This uh, probably was the least favorite meal I had while I was in the area, but it was still decent. Thanks for watching, I really appreciate it. And if you would just click on the little circle here with a picture of my head in there and subscribe to the Nola Jet channel, it would really help me a lot. I really appreciate it. Thank you.